So with earlier looking at the Samsung Galaxy S4, we did say we'd compare it to earlier and competitive devices on the market. Initially, we'll look at comparing it to the Samsung Galaxy S3, and then we'll move on and look at comparing that device, uh, the Samsung Galaxy S4, with the iPhone 5. So initially, Samsung S3 owners will notice the slight increase in the screen size from 4.8 to the 5-inch uh, screen, but really the uh, talking point with the S4 is that AMOLED HD resolution screen. So yes, this is AMOLED on the S3, but the AMOLED here is just at that high density, just enough to make it so visibly notable in not just the icons, but also in the multimedia and on-screen uh, images that you can see within the device and play through the device. There are improvements obviously within the processing power and the uh, speed in general of the device, the increase in the Android 4.1 to 4.1.2 seen in the S4. Now the iPhone in comparison to the S4, the iPhone has pretty much stayed uh, static with some design changes in the uh, lengthening of this device with the iPhone 5 of course, uh, but in its general terms it has been the same device for a number of generations now. In terms of the out of the box functionality, it does have email but third party applications are required if you wish to re access Word, Excel and PowerPoint. Within the Samsung range, this has always been uh, core to be able to open this with the Polaris Office system, Word, Excel and PowerPoint can be opened within there. But in general terms, these devices, people are choosing devices now and looking for a larger screen. They want better resolution for multimedia functionality, for information on the go, as well as being able to entertainment on the go. This device will offer that higher screen resolution, the larger screen and also those bells and whistles that we looked at within the earlier video of the gesture based controls and interesting control features which may not necessarily be important for every single user uh, but there is there are a large number of people who will be looking for that functionality. So in comparing uh, various different smartphones uh, we're looking at uh, comparisons of different features, different functionalities. The S3 could probably be comparable to the iPhone 5 but the S4 is Samsung's showcase of future technologies, of gesture-based controls, uh, of higher resolution screens, and just larger screen technologies uh, for the general user. So do look with interest with our earlier videos uh, regarding the S4 and the detailed features within that, and also look back here for more information and more smartphones to follow.